was the night before Christmas, and all through the house, not a creature was stirring. Not even up. Jimmy, can you believe that it's almost Christmas Day? The greatest celebration of the whole year. Well, actually, maybe the second greatest, after my birthday, of course. You know what, Jimmy? I think you were right the first time. Christmas is the best day of the year. And I'm one step ahead of you. I've already started decorating the Christmas tree. Wow, looks amazing, Ellie. Very sparkly. You know, they don't call you sparkles for nothing. Me, on the other hand, I've been focusing on the Santa snacks. The problem is, I got a little hungry and ate most of the popcorn and drank most of the OJ. I hope Santa understands. It's all right, Jimmy. You know what? Why don't we stick with tradition this year? Milk and cookies. Just whipped it up. Mmm, you know, they do smell pretty delicious. I think you might be right. Don't want to mess with Santa's routine after all. Hey, you mind if I sample one? That's why I baked us a fresh new batch just for us in the kitchen. Awesome. You know what? I think you're right. Christmas really is the greatest day of the year. I can't believe it's almost Christmas morning. The day that we've waited for all year. Candy canes and lights aglow. Carolers and lots of snow. And tons of snowballs I can throw. Bullseye! It's almost here. singing Christmas carols without me? <coughs> Joy to the world, Putrock goes here, and Christmas time is here. Ugh, I should have asked Santa for some earplugs. All right, we'll save the singing for later. Let's go through the Christmas checklist. Oh, don't worry about that, Coach Rocco. We covered everything. The tree, the decorations, the milk and cookies. <laughs> uh, but aren't you forgetting the most important part? The Christmas star for a top of the tree. Now let's get this stool and put this beautiful baby up there. Um, Coach Rocco, are you sure you want to do this? Because last year, remember when you did it and you fell over and the tree fell over and it was a whole thing and... Yeah, and if I remember correctly, the same thing happened last year. And come to think of it, the year before that. Come on, you two. The Christmas star is a tradition. Besides, I've been practicing all year for this moment, so I hopefully won't knock it down this time. <laughs> okay, so if you'll do me the honor and hold the... Um, stool here. Watch your fingers, okay? Now if I just not breathe while I'm up here, I have a better chance. There we go. There we go. Okay, holding my breath. All right, Coach Rocco. Do this. Oh, oh. Don't breathe. Don't breathe. Oh, oh, oh. I got it. I got it. <laughs> Dawn. Back away very carefully. Now. It's a Christmas miracle. Huh? And I'm on the floor. <laughs> All right. Checklist done. Now you two better run upstairs and get some shut eye before Santa arrives. Oh, you got it. Come on, Jimmy, let's go. It's gonna be the greatest Christmas ever. <laughs> <sighs> Come in. Hey, Ellie. I'm glad to see you're in bed. Merry almost Christmas. Merry Christmas, Coach Rocco. The next time I wake up, it's gonna be Christmas Day. Wait, Coach, did you forget something? Psst, psst, Ellie, it's me. Jimmy, what are you doing here? Here's the plan. We wait for Coach Rocco to fall asleep, and then we secretly sneak downstairs, and voila, we'll get a glimpse of Santa. I don't 
no, Jimmy, this seems like a silly plan. And doesn't Coach Rocco say that Santa only comes when we're fast asleep? Oh, I know, but come on, Ellie. Haven't you ever wanted to see Santa Claus in person and get a glimpse of that big red nose or that big round belly? We'll be able to tell everyone in school. It'll be so cool. <laughs> no sign of Jimmy yet. <laughs> Jimmy tries to sneak out every year. But no one can get past Night Watchman Rocco. I'm practically Santa's little helper. Ho, ho, ho. I wonder where Ellie left that extra batch of cookies. Better not, though. Uniform's getting a little tight. <laughs> Come on, Ellie. What do you say? Hmm, I do admit I've always wanted to meet Santa. Exactly. Just think of all the things that we could ask him. Ooh. I'll ask him for a basketball when I meet Santa. I'll ask him for a brand new doll when I meet Santa. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, it'll be a dream come true. We have to try because we want to be the first kids in history to meet Santa Claus. Those kids better not be planning to sneak out. I'll stay up all night if I have to. Bring a camera, cause we gotta get through that we met Santa Claus. Well, Ellie, are you in? I'm in, but we have to be super quiet, okay? Okay, okay, very quiet. There's nothing that could stop us now. Not even Coach Rocco! Shh. Coach? Oh, phew, looks like he's fast asleep. Yeah, lucky for us, Coach Rocco is the heaviest sleeper in the whole world. And have you ever heard him snore? <laughs> it sounds like an earthquake. <laughs> I do not what? sound like an earthquake. And what are you two doing outside of your bedroom? Uh, 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 why don't you tell him, Jimmy? Oh, well, you see, Coach Rocco, the funny thing is that Ellie and I were uh, just on cookie patrol. Yeah, that's right. We just wanted to make sure that there were enough cookies for Santa. Yep, uh, one, two, three, four, five. That's enough cookies for Santa. Nice try, you two, but you better get back to bed or it's the naughty list for the both of you. Oh, but come on, Coach Rocco. Santa's going to be here any minute. Uh, just so one little baby. No, no, on delay, on delay. We can have a cookie or two. There's one. Ho, ho, ho!
and you know what that means. Presents. Oh boy, oh boy, oh boy. Yes. Come to Jimmy. Here's one for me. And I found one of mine. And this one says, Coach Rocco, Santa remembered me. He really remembered. Thank you, Santa. Oh boy, just what I've always wanted, my very own sweater. Oh, seems a little small. And I got a brand new set of walkie talkies. Oh, and I got a duster. Oh, that's so cool. I wish I would have got one of those. No way, Coach Rocco. Your present is the coolest. I've always wanted a set of walkie talkies. Wait, you guys, I think there must be some kind of mistake here. Oh, I know exactly what you're talking about. We should have put out popcorn and OJ for Santa, like I said. But we put out milk and cookies, and now he's making us pay the price. No, Jimmy. I'm saying that Santa must have put the wrong labels on the presents by mistake. So this must be for Coach Rocco. <gasps> so that means this is for Jimmy. And if these are mine, then this sweater must actually be for Ellie. Yeah, that makes more sense. I guess sometimes even Santa makes mistakes. See, it all worked out in the end. We all got what we wanted for Christmas. I can't wait to try this out. Let's start our Christmas chores now. Aww. Come on, let's go dust the TV room. What? You promised no chores on Christmas. Go Rocco, we gotta finish opening the presents. Guys, I'm sure they'll come back for their presents. They always do. <laughs> Merry Christmas, everyone. Enough. Jimmy Bells, Jimmy Bells, Jimmy all the way. <laughs> what do you think of my new Christmas carol? I personally think it might be the best song we've ever sung. No way. The best song we ever sang was for the band in the school talent show, remember? We had the puppet involved. Yes, Taco the Pirate. Arrgh. You guys, you guys, I finally finished the song I've been working on. And I think it might be the most awesomest song ever written. Wait a second, what's Coach Rocco's puppet doing here? Arg, who are you calling a puppet? Oh, Jimmy, meet Taco the Pirate. He's your newest band member. Band member? What are you talking about? Okay, so listen up, you guys. Jimmy, you were getting anxious about singing your song. And Coach Rocco, you were nervous about performing in front of people. So I decided, what helps me when I'm nervous and anxious? Why, teamwork, of course. So I decided, let's make a band. Hey. Oh, a band? That's a good idea, Ellie. <laughs> yeah, so Jimmy, you get to sing the song that you wrote, and I'm gonna play the ukulele, and Coach Rocco, you get to make Taco sing along with Jimmy. Hey, since we're all gonna be performing together, why don't we think of an awesome band name? Oh, that's a great idea. How about the Jimmy Fan Club? Uh, I don't think so. Nah. Jimmy and the Jimmies? Nah. Oh, I got it. Jimmy time. Okay, uh, why don't we think about the fan name after we have our first session? <laughs> All right, time for our first round of practice. Jimmy, song ready? Ready. Taco, you ready? I'm ready. All right, on three. A one and a two and a... When we're playing basketball, that makes Jimmy smile. When we're eating sandwiches, that makes Jimmy smile. With a basket here and a sandwich there. Dribble there, pickle there, spin a rooney everywhere. When we're singing Jimmy's songs, that makes Jimmy smile. Take it away, Taco. When I find me gold coins, that makes Taco smile. When I sing a jolly song, that makes Taco smile. With a gold coin here and a gold coin there, golden coins everywhere. When I find me gold coins, that makes Taco smile. That's a guy. When we're swimming in the pool, that makes Jimmy smile. When there's a day off from school, that makes Jimmy smile. With a backstroke here and a holiday there, swimming there, sleeping there, spin a rooney everywhere. When I'm singing with my friends, that makes Jimmy smile. And it's totally awesome. Yeah! Awesome job, Jimmy! Awesome job, Taco! Talent show, here we come! <laughs> now that's what I call teamwork. Kind of like how we're all decorating the tree right now. Hey, Coach Rocco, what's your favorite song memory? Oh, that's easy. Remember that song we sang while we headed to the big Halloween party? Oh, you mean the one when you were scared of everything and Count Jimmy had to save you? This is a bad idea. I don't like the sound of this. Ah, something just touched my arm. I think it was a ghost. I think that was just the wind, Coach Rocco. Ah!
Something just rubbed against my leg. I, I know it was a werewolf. Coach Rocco, it was probably just a mosquito. Oh, I'll never get used to this Halloween mumbo jumbo. I should just turn back. This is a big mistake. No. There's nothing wrong with being scared of things, Coach Rocco. Everybody is. For example, I'm scared of monsters and spooky creatures. I'm scared of spiders and I'm scared of angry teachers. I'm scared of zombies and creepy movies. I'm scared that I won't get to do my spin -a rooney Yeah, everyone gets scared sometimes, but it's normal and it's fine. We all get scared, oh yeah we do. Even me, even me, and even you. What about you, Coach Rocco? What are you scared of? Oh, I'd rather not say. See if you can guess. You're scared of mummies? No. You're scared of bad dreams? No. You're scared of running out of pickle-flavored ice cream? Well, sort of. What about werewolves? Nuh-uh. Or stuff that's yucky? No. Well, then what are you scared of, Coach? Rubber duckies. Hold on. You're scared of rubber duckies? Aw, Coach Rocco, it's so nice that you remembered that one. Yep, and I'm happy to say Coach Rocco is no longer afraid of rubber duckies. Wait, hold on, hold on, hold on. I think we're forgetting the greatest song of all. You know, the one we sung about the coolest kid in school. Oh, brother, how could I forget that one? Voila! My masterpiece is complete. This song is dedicated to someone very special to me. Ellie, give me an E. There's someone that I know from school. His name is Jimmy and he's cool. Well, he's the coolest boy in school. Jimmy is cool. And everybody knows he rules at basketball and Roblox too. If you don't like him, you're a fool. Cause he's cool. Everybody know Jimmy is so very cool. Jimmy is so very cool. He's the coolest boy in school. Jimmy is cool. He likes to wear the color orange. Oh, oh no. Oh, nothing rhymes with orange. But, but regardless, he is cool. And Jelly, you're okay too. Aww. Everyone, Jimmy is so very cool. Jimmy is so very cool. Jimmy is so very cool. Jimmy is cool! Yeah. Awesome! <laughs> what a beautiful song. I get a little choked up every time I hear it, you know. There, there, Jimmy. Hey, you guys, we did it! We finished decorating for Christmas. Hooray! And that means we have some cookies to eat. Wasn't that a fun activity? Yay! Yeah, and you know what else is a fun activity? Cleaning the pool. Remember the song we sang about that? Oh, no, not that one. My father was a singer and my mother is a dancer, so maybe I got some of those Rocco jeans. Maybe we do a channel that's singing and dancing. That's a great idea, Coach Rocco. There are plenty of YouTube channels like that. All right, Jimmy, you ready? Yup. Three, two, one, action. Hello, Spark. I mean, uh, Coach Alinos, uh, welcome to the Coach Rocco Show. We're here with my bestest friend, Ellie. <laughs> Hit it, Ellie. Okay, um, let's see, we're gonna be singing a song about pool skimming. Um, cleaning the pool is so cool. Cleaning the pool is so cool. <laughs> Anyone in here? 
then the presents must be alone and unprotected. You see, it's almost time for my annual gift swap with Ellie and Coach Rocco, but I just can't wait any longer to see what Ellie's gonna give me this year. That's why I've decided to take a little sneak peek, if you know what I mean. Jim Aroonies, if you wanna see me get a special sneak preview of what I'm getting in the gift swap this year, give me a big thumbs up. Which present should I pick? Ooh, they all look so inviting. I think I'll take this one. Not so fast, Jimmy. I caught you. I'll take that. Yeah, Jimmy, you know the rules. You can't be snooping around the presents before a gift swap. Wait a second. That's a rule? I can't snoop around the presents before the gift swap? Oh, I wish I had known that. Otherwise, I never would have done it. You and I both know that Jimmy doesn't like to break the rules. Nice try, Jimmy, but you say that excuse every year. You know the no snooping rule has always been around. Hmm, I'm sorry, you guys, but I just can't wait any longer. Do you think maybe we could just open one gift ahead of time? Come on, just one gift. Okay, Jimmy, just one gift for each person, all right? Awesome, this is gonna be the best gift swap ever. Ooh, Ellie, open mine first. It's the biggest present. That's how you know it's the best one. Wow, that's so nice, Jimmy. I wonder what this is. <laughs> oh, wow, Jimmy, it's a life-size cutout of you. How? I know, best gift ever, right? Well, it's definitely unique. I gotta figure out what I'm gonna do with this, but I'm sure I'll find something. Thanks, Jimmy. You're welcome. Hey, I recognize this photo. It's from when I took those school photographs. Oh, yeah! How could I forget that day? <laughs> All right, on the count of three, say cheese. One, two, three. Cheese! Oh, I can't figure this thing out. Since when they put cameras in phones anyway? Here, let me help you. Oh, no wonder you have it in selfie mode. Okay, let me just turn it around. And there you go, that should do it. Oh, much better. Okay, say cheese. Cheese! Okay, that's a keeper. All right, who's next? Jimmy! All right, Jimmy, have a seat, and when you're ready, say cheese. Cheeseburger. <laughs> Jimmy, I said say cheese, not cheeseburger. Now have a seat. Jimmy, come on. Yeah, good luck with that, Coach. Jimmy hates having his photos taken. Remember last year's photos? Boy, do I ever. Now, Jimmy, I want to get a good photo this year. The sooner we get this done, the sooner you can go outside and play basketball. Ooh, that gives me a great idea. I can definitely get a good photo of Jimmy, Coach. Hey, Jimmy, can you teach me how to do that spin a rooney thing you do? Is it dunk, spin, spin, or spin, dunk, spin, or what? You asked for it, you got it. One Jimmy special coming right up. The Jimmy Spin a Rooney. The crowd goes wild. They're cheering, Jimmy, Jimmy, Jimmy. Okay, stay like that. Perfect. Wait a second, did you just take my picture? You tricked me. Yeah, but think about it this way. When you're a famous basketball player, they're gonna wanna take your photo for the basketball card. And look at how good that photo is. Wow, I think that actually might be the best photo ever taken. You really captured the essence of the spinner room. <laughs> you know what? I think this is a really good picture of you, Jimmy. Yeah, everyone should have one of these babies. It's gonna be this season's hot new item. Oh, Coach Rocco. I got my gift for you. Here oh. you go. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. I wonder what it could be. It's a new hat. And look, it's just my style. What do you think? Pretty sharp, huh? A hat? Go Draco, that's a new megaphone. Oh, I needed a new megaphone. Thank you. Yeah, I figured you might need a new one since Jimmy keeps breaking your old ones. What? When have I ever broken one of Coach Rocco's megaphones? I don't remember that ever happening. Well, I do. Spin a Rooney. Jimmy, now come on, it's time for your swim lesson. Now put that basketball down. Better yet, give it to me. Give it to you? Sure thing, Coach. Ah! <laughs> Coach Rocco, you forgot your megaphone. Oh, great, you found it. Could you bring it down? I need it. Throw it down? No, I said bring it down. 
Okay, I'll throw it. Ah! you did oops and now for the amazing Jimmy's greatest trick yet I will be making that megaphone disappear Zim Zalakaruni he's using my megaphone Ellen Zim Zalakaruni ta-da whoa it actually worked I may actually be the greatest magician of all time wow that's a cool trick Jimmy yeah, now, now can you make it reappear? I, I need it for class. And reappear? Well, no, I haven't figured out how to do that part yet. Uh, Hi, Jimmy! Well, oh, time to make myself disappear. Oh. It's okay, Coach. I'll get you a new one. Okay, except maybe for that one time that I accidentally misplaced the megaphone. Uh, well, anyway, now you got a spare one. And now that you two have opened your gifts, it's Jimmy's turn. Who wants to give Jimmy a present? Here, open this one from me. Oh boy, oh boy. Can't wait to see what this is. An orange coat shirt. Oh, I've always wanted one of these. Very stylish color. Yeah, I knew you'd like it. Remember that day he wanted to be coach so bad all day. Oh yeah, I remember that. Coach Jimmy. <laughs> I wonder where Coach Rocco is. He's running late. Wait a minute, how late is he? Mm, looks about two minutes, I think. Perfect. You know the rules. If Coach Rocco's two minutes late to class, that means that I get to be coach for the day. Awesome! Jimmy, I don't think that's a real rule. All right, everyone. Coach Jimmy's class is in session. And since I'm the coach, I say that today is basketball day. We'll be learning how to do the world famous Jimmy Spin Rooney from the master himself, me. <laughs> Jimmy, if you're gonna be coach for the day, you should at least try and be a lot like Coach Rocco. Be more like Coach Rocco, you say? Hmm. You mean like this? Hey everyone, I'm Coach Rocco, and this is my gym class. Jimmy, stop playing basketball. It's time to clean the pool. Cleaning the pool is so cool. Whoops, I accidentally fell in the pool. Splash. Ah, doggy paddle, doggy paddle. Ah, someone pull me uh, out. Ah, I'm the coach, I'm the coach, I'm the coach, I'm the coach. Hey, Coach Rocco. I was just uh, warming up the class for you. Well, looks like they're all warmed up. <laughs> you want your shirt back? <laughs> you gotta admit, my Coach Rocco impression was spot on. Yep, good times, good times, <laughs> Wayne. What's going on here? I figured if you could be Coach Rocco, I get to be Jimmy. Well, that sounds fair to me. What? <laughs> That's not fair. Come on, Coach Rocco, give us your best Jimmy. Look at me, I'm Jimmy. I'm the most awesomest boy in school. <laughs> hey, I sound nothing like that. Look at my special, special spin book movies. <laughs> 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 Wasn't that video super fun, Sparkle Squad? Boys and girls, if you want to watch more of my videos, make sure you type Ellie Sparkles in the search bar. And mom and dad, if you want to learn more about me, you can check out my website at elliesparkles.com, my Instagram, Ellie Sparkles Official, or on Facebook at Ellie Sparkles. <laughs> See you soon!